Do you know this trick that everyone is talking about at the moment? It's simply ingenious and solves a problem that I'm sure you know too. Because if you want to use some flour because you want to bake something or generally for a recipe and you want to tip the whole thing into a bowl, then you also know the problem that you usually have some flour on the work surface afterwards because it just shoots out too far at the front. Or you only need a small amount of flour and far too much comes right out of the bag. Instead you should just use whisk in future. Because if you go into the floor bag with a whisk, you can go all the way to the bottom once, pull the whisk out again and, as you can see here, have the floor hanging directly in the whisk. It doesn't fall off easily either. Only when you shake the whisk, the floor falls down and if there is too much, you just take the rest back to the bag and shake it in there. This trick works with any kind of floor, by the way. And as you can see here, I just go into the bag with it, pull the whisk back up and it's full of floor. And of course this works not only if you have the floor in a bag, but also if you already have your floor in a plastic box or other container. Again you just go in with the whisk, pull it out and you have the floor right in here. So the next time you need some floor make sure you try this trick. Do you also want to know why you should definitely put two sponges in your washing machine compartment? Then watch the video I'm linking to you here. You will make me really happy if you click the like button and subscribe to my channel.